This video is going to show you how to create a new and Hibernate project from an existing database. Visual and Hibernate supports many different databases. Select which one you want to use and enter the details. Then click Create Project. Visual and Hibernate has imported all the tables from the database for you, as well as creating the entities. You can select an entity by clicking on it in the tree view, or double clicking the entity in the designer. You can also double click tables to view their details. To view details of references between entities, hover over the reference line and little edit buttons will appear. Click these to view the details. To see details about how the entity maps to its tables, click the icon. You can see more details about the entity as well as all its properties at the bottom of the screen. Visual and Hibernate also allows you to add custom code such as namespaces, attributes, base names, properties, and functions. This advanced functionality will be covered in a separate video. Many settings are available for you to specify exactly how you want your Hibernate project to work. We are almost ready to start generating the files. Click on the File Generation tab, then set your output folder. This is the folder where you want to write the files to. Once you've set this, Visual Hibernate will start generating the files and then analyzing them for differences to see what's changed between them and existing files. Although the files have been generated, they haven't been written to disk yet. Visual and Hibernate allows you to inspect the files to check that they're all correct. Once you're happy that everything is right, you can click the Write Files to Disk button to actually write them to disk. By default, all files will get generated. However, you can select which ones you don't want to get generated. Once the files are written to disk, you can open them and view them. Double click the Visual Studio Solution file to open it in Visual Studio. We've reached the end of this video. Thanks for watching.